welcome back to our channel in today's vlog we'll be showing you our typical summer holiday morning routine we absolutely love the summer holidays we love being off school don't we guys yeah yeah and our mornings are really chilled we yes. like to get up late yeah we like to chill in the mornings and then yes. we like to get on yes. with things in the afternoon yes yes, yes. Yes, 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 yes. So we're going to take you with us and show you what a typical summer holiday morning in the Piggott house looks like. So this is how the morning started. It's 6.30, if you can see on the clock. <laughs> my alarm goes off at 6.15. Only through the summer holidays, I try and get my work done as early as possible in the morning. So excuse the rawness. <laughs> Very realistic vlog for you guys this week. The struggle with juggling work and childcare this summer has actually been quite tough as it's summer holiday i don't wake the kids up at any set time they can wake up whenever they want i just don't make plans at first thing in the morning they tend to wake up logan's first usually around nine o'clock um and then the girls like half past nine i suppose holly even later but as we're filming this it is the end of the summer holiday so we have had to start waking them up so with ryan's shift work it can be tricky because as you know he, he works very random hours so as i'm filming this today he's done a night shift and he's not home yet first things first the thing that we always yeah. have no matter what happens is a cup of tea mm. good morning good morning hello hello <laughs> tired ready for bed yeah the only one who doesn't have a cup of tea in the morning yeah <laughs> keep you awake I was thinking, oh, I really fancy cup of tea, but I'm like, no, it's not worth it. I don't know what time to wake the kids up today, maybe 8 o'clock? I think it's probably got to be 8 o'clock, get them back into the school morning routine. I know, I think we do as well. Help us to just get up and out. I can just take the kids out for breakfast or something, just so that you can fall asleep with the house quiet. Snuggly snuggles. Did you have a good sleep? Yeah. I'm wake up some sleepy girls. Mm. Good morning. This is well early for you. Oh my goodness. This one's been like a teenager these summer holidays, like not waking up until half past ten. Hey? It's not even eight o'clock. Oh my god. Ah, gotta get you ready for school, baby. Good morning, Olivia. Oh. Used to these early mornings. Where's my little Livy Lolos? She's, She's like, no! <laughs> Ryan, that's mean! I feel like it was one of those two-second sleeps. Oh, they're oh, the worst. I hate yeah. a two-second sleep. A two-second sleep is the worst. I genuinely only had two seconds of sleep. Yeah, all right. There is was it? a fox trying to raid our food Ooh, waste bin. So you thought you'd have a little look and shake the blind at it? <laughs> it actually kept me awake. It kept me awake for a really long time. And I was thinking, if you was in the bed, I could have sent you out to shoo it away. But I was really frightened it would, like, jump and attack my face or something <laughs> oh, if I went really? outside. What's in your hair? It's a sock. What is that? It's a sock. What's this for? When did you do that? I did it when I was going to sleep. I got like <laughs> a big section of hair and just wrapped it up. Is it going to be all curly now though? Yeah. Come on, I, then. I was going to make it so it just kind of goes like that. Right, tea. That's the idea, isn't it? Tea is done. Bottle's done. You guys want to see my hair? I really want to see what you're going to do with this. Oh wow. Keep those curls. It was because my bangs were like dead straight and then the rest of my hair is like this. But now the bangs are like... <laughs> they look really cool. You look really beautiful now. Oh, no. ah! Hard work for you. He gives us no. <laughs> Leo does like to give us kisses. Yeah, but yeah. I'm not kissing him yeah. in the nose because yeah. he licks himself like... All of himself. Oh yeah, all of him. Whereabouts? Whereabouts? What, what does he? What does he lick? Everywhere. He licks his butthole. <laughs> yeah. Because it's all wet. Yeah, grossness. I like and it smells like cat food. Yeah. yeah, cat food. I'm going to show you guys my skincare now. And the sock curls actually worked. Not as well though as heatless curls would, but you know. What are you doing? Doing my skincare. Can I do it? Yeah. To find a headband, which is very tricky to do. I found one. Can't put the bow back in. 
Okay, so beautiful. First, we have to wash our face, which we do in the bathroom. So, yeah. we're going to the bathroom. So I use the tea tree body shop one. You need to wet your face. No one will do it. I like that. <laughs> You have not watched that off properly, there's loads and loads of it. Nivea, two in one. Cleanse out and turn off. Whack him in the face. Time. This serum. How do you do serum? I've never used that serum before. So it's skin. So you, I know it. I know that you don't squeeze it. Vitamins Illuminating Serum. Nine. Which I got from Tesco. And there's <laughs> lots of them, so. Very good though. Okay. That's a lot. Bloop, bloop. What does it do to your face? Illuminate. I did this to Logan the other day, just to <laughs> serum, because he was asking me. And he was so relaxed, he was like. He was literally falling asleep. Ooh. So cold. No, it was really nice. At the moment, I'm just kind of experimenting. I used to only do cleanser and toner and simple moisturizer. Yeah, whenever I did it with her, then it felt so short, and I was like, "Really, it's already over?" Yeah, but then I got the tea tree face wash, and. Now I have the serum, I have Biomus, like, melting balm, I have CeraVe moisturiser on my face, so yeah. Anyway, this one dries really quickly, like, for your face now. Oh my goodness. And blub, blub, blub. And then you just rub it in, yeah? Uh, yeah. <laughs> Everything in your skin, skin, in your skincare routine is like, rub it in. Everything in everyone's skincare routine, you have to rub it in, basically. I basically had this Revolution lip gloss, and it was empty, so I washed it out, and I put um, the rose Vaseline in it. My goodness. Smooth as a baby's bottom. <coughs> How do you know what that feels like? Um, because everyone says that baby's bottoms are really smooth. So yeah. And that's the end of my skincare. Ooh, show us your outfit. Oh, hello. <laughs> what have you picked today? Let's see. Mickey Mouse tea, grey shorts. Brush those teeth well. Right, let's make the beds. Open the curtains. I'm really tired. I don't know why. Well, because mummy had to wake you up a bit earlier so that you're getting ready for the back to school. Oh. Hello again. Uh, Back to school stuff. Let's make beds and let's go get breakfast. I'm absolutely starving. I'm so hungry. My stomach is grumbling. I've been up since quarter past six. I don't even know what time is now. Anyone know what the time is? Okay. Alexa, what's the time? The time is 8.59 a.m. I still Nearly nine o'clock. No, you still wouldn't be awake. Nine o'clock. Is it hard trying to stay quiet in the mornings when daddy's asleep? No. How have you found that in the summer holidays, trying to stay quiet when Daddy's coming off a night shift? It's kind of, it's kind of hard. My mum says, Logan turn the TV down. Olivia and Millie, her friend, and Elsie, her friend, was having a sleepover, and they were stomping really loud when I was asleep, and I couldn't go to sleep. They were actually stomping so loud downstairs, and jumping on your beds, that the bedroom door was like vibrating yeah it was no because because um millie had an idea that we should be donna and the dynamos because <laughs> we were watching mommy and here we go again number two right i really do feel like we need to get out of the house now let daddy go to sleep oh hair 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 right come on come on come on right let's get a quick update from ryan shoes on then my kids i have a companion with me i think he's gonna stay in the bed with you i think he is too. right good night good night See you in a few hours. Yes. No night, Leo. Oh, your bike is in here too, Logan. 
I don't really fancy teaching you to ride a bike though today. Here we go, my darling. Oh, look at you guys. Oh, you did all that scooting? Logan, would you like a sausage bap? You like those? Don't fancy it. Toast? I'm going to get a white toast with butter and a medium hot chocolate. Actually, we're going to have one of these. Yeah, orange juice. All oh, right, okay. Apple juice and six slices of toast. And I think I'm going to have a sausage bat. I think I want one of them. They're very nice. I want one of them. I want one of them. What? Because it doesn't have ketchup in? Did you think it had ketchup? So you want one of these now, not toast? Okay. I still want toast. Look at the size of this. Seriously, go on. Like, yeah. We've gone a long way from just a baby tuna. Who's was which ones? I can't remember. Um, how how is it 30 degrees outside? Yeah, it's not that cold in Costa, and you have a hoodie on. How? And you have a hot chocolate. Oh my goodness. <laughs> Making you sweat just looking at her. I'm trusting you, Mum. This isn't nice then. Is that bird then? Yeah. Got that on camera. Yeah. Right, you got your toast. Oh, what was that little hack? Hold on. Um, it makes the bottom more melted and easier to spread. Logan, the point is to eat the sausage inside the bap. No, because they both actually fell out. Do you think Daddy would have fallen asleep by now? Yeah. Do you, are you guys used to his shift work and him working night shifts and stuff? Yeah. 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 It's all you've ever known, isn't it? Mm -hmm. Yum. Yeah. So good, isn't it? really like the sausages. Yeah, really nice. Greasy fingers after this. One of the comments in our last video was what tips do you have for each year that you're going into now? So what tips do you have for going into year one and finishing reception? Olivia, what tips do you have if anyone's going to year three or starting year four? Holly, I don't suppose you've got any tips for starting year seven, yeah. but... No, I have tips for starting year four and year six. You have some tips for year... It's not bad. It's no. Really bad. It's fun. And it thing? goes by so fast, so don't like waste time. What this hits me? And it's very sad when we last Yeah, it's so it's sad. sad. Tips, Logan, as advice. So something to help people if they're starting school. I feel happy that I'm going to year one. Yeah. My teacher is really nice. I have a great time we, we go in there. Oh, you get to go in, yeah, you get to go in the big playground this year, don't you? Big boy. And big, big climbing playground. You don't feel nervous about going into the big playground this time? No. Olivia, have you got any advice for starting Key Stage 2, Year 3, or going into Year 4? Uh, yeah, I have some tips for Year 3. Sometimes it's a bit nerve-wracking, but um, I felt it really, I felt really um, not nervous because um, when the new year, New Year threes come in, then you can make new friends, and it's actually really nice. Yeah. Okay. Can't not go to the playground when it's a sunny day, can you? Yeah. It's a little detour to the playground. Logan, where did we stop on the way here? What have we bought? We're going to make tie-dye t-shirts. Yeah, That's in we, uh, Paradise Blue. Yeah, we're we're going to make some tie dyes. So everyone else chose their own colour, and then everyone decided that they wanted to use my colour. So now we don't have to buy three packets, we only have to buy one. That's good, yeah, because you all started with a packet each to start with, didn't you? Yeah. Yeah. And then everyone was like, oh my god. So are we going to go home and make tie dye t shirts? No, oh, not yet. Not no, 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 I didn't mean yet. I meant in a minute. Yeah. What's Olivia up to? Yeah. You right, Liv? Can I take my shoes off? Um, okay, but just make sure you put them back on in a minute in case it's broken glass on the floor, okay? Okay. Deal? Yeah. 11.15. Oh my gosh. And we lift at? I don't know, like nine, like two and a bit hours. But it's still not time to wake Daddy up. So should we all just have a really cold drink, cool off, and then we can make the tie-dye t-shirts before we wake Dad up? Sound like a plan? Yeah. yeah. And then yeah. I think... It's probably a day for a sprinkler because it's too hot to go out and about yeah. today. Yeah. It's such a hot day. 
sprinkler in the garden, everyone? Mum, yeah. you can get in the sprinkler with us because I don't want you to leave to be hot. Okay. So you can get in the sprinkler with us. Sprinkler day. So, tie dye time. Not my one. I don't know, actually. No. no, Logan's. Okay, so I've got a big bag of I'm rubber bands. A way. Oh, wow. <gasps> oh, cool. Come on in. You've got to come and help me. Come here. Come. Come here. I shall show you. You take a little section, Logan, and you twist it around like that. Yeah? Mm hmm And then you tie that in an elastic band. Then we oh. put colours in it. Okay. Then you just put, put it in there. Okay, I don't think there's going to be a lot of white on there. I think you need some more elastic bands on there. Holly's not giving up on this fork twisting method. Right, Logan, what are you doing? So what I've enjoyed about this summer is um, Auntie Sarah's wedding, that was really fun and the all of the songs there was really fun, you know, it was not like like a usual re wedding, it's because it was a renewal, it was a bit like, like crazy and fun. And I also enjoyed going to the big ball pit and I really enjoyed going on our um, holiday. Uh, going to a little caravan holiday and then I had the sleepover my first ever sleepover some things I've enjoyed about the summer holidays is well my favorite thing was definitely on Sarah's wedding because it was like best wedding ever and if that's the only wedding I go to then my wedding's gonna be pretty disappointing <laughs> I met someone on induction day at my new secondary school so that because I've been separated from all of my friends and um, I met her in my class and we met up in the summer holidays. I really enjoyed the Haven holiday because camping was cancelled and we went to that little holiday instead. I was quite disappointed about camping. I was very upset. I enjoyed the wedding. I hope my wedding's gonna be like Auntie Sarah's. I learned, I, and I enjoyed to learn to ride in my bike. I was very happy that Daddy J digged in the trampoline. Whoa. It's going well. Looks good. It's already, the timer has ended. Yeah. We will update you guys. So the time now is 20 past 12, so that is officially the morning finished. Yeah. Um, we're still going to make these tie-dye t-shirts, so we will update you on how those come out, but it is now time to go and wake Ryan up. Yes. We need to pop to the school uniform shop this afternoon. Because my yeah. skirts are too big. They're too small. Too small. Too tight. We have to but buy we do too have many. one spare. So we also have to pop to the shoe shop and go and get some insoles for your shoes because you stole Olivia's insoles from her shoes so she yeah. now needs those as well. And the school do have like an induction hour as well so Logan can go and meet his teacher. We're going to get these finished, going to go and play in the sprinklers and we will see you next week. Thanks Bye. so much for watching. Bye. Bye.